morning everybody. It is 10.35. Ash and I are going to run out. Ash had bought a camera yesterday. Uh, well, she wanted more of a video camera. She can't find a video camera anywhere. And she's ready to start making some YouTube videos for her channel. I told her she could use this, but she needs one because of showing uh, ingredients and different things on makeup items. She wanted one that zoomed in really clearly. And we all know that this one has given me some problems. So she picked one up yesterday that was more of a camera but did great video and she loved the camera but it wasn't exactly what she wanted. When she tried it out last night it wasn't exactly zooming the way she hoped. So we're going to go out and exchange that, probably pick up a sandwich and come home. Um, by the time you see this you'll have seen my other vlog anyway. Yesterday's vlog will go up when I get back. I have to edit it still. Um, like I said last night we didn't get back from dinner until... Well, we finished dinner and then we went a walk along the pier and then we went to the train station to drop Matt and Claire off and we waited with them till the train as you do and no Claire and Matt they kept telling us go home leave us here are you kidding so we waited with them and then by the time we got home we were all talking and saying what a great time we'd had which we did it was absolutely fantastic I uh, can't think too much about them going home today because I would love them to stay longer but I know they're girls are at home. Hi Macy! Hi Paige! And all the puppies and animals and Alfie. We've heard all about you guys and I feel like we know you and uh, next time your mum comes and Matt comes you guys have to come as well. Start saving! Um, but yeah it was absolutely brilliant. She and Matt are exactly how you expect them to be. No falseness, no nothing and you know we were together three full days and not once were we looking for conversation. There was no weird quietness or, okay, what should we talk about next? Looking up into the air, none of that. It was constant, constant chatting and laughing and uh, all that good stuff. It was really brilliant. So back to boring routine today. Ash and I, like I said, we're gonna leave now. She's just took the dogs out for a wee wee. The next two weeks for Pete are gonna be pretty quiet, which is a shame. Um, I guess there's quiet time for commercial photography, but we're just going to fill up as many days with senior portraits as possible and try and get the majority of these kids taken care of before school. But I hear the dog, so I know Ash is in now, so I'm going to love and leave you guys for a bit. I was just watching Elaine 12 Jones, and we're on our way. It's absolutely beautiful today. No humidity at all at the moment. Iron my shorts. I was watching you, John Harrison, ironing as I was ironing my shorts. So, you ready, hun? Yeah. Alright, we'll put them down. I'm coming. Oh, I'm in shorts, Ash is in jeans. I'm about to change into shorts. Oh, she's about to change into shorts because it's harder out than I thought. Good. Then I won't feel awkward. <laughs> Alright, guys, we'll see you along the way. Bye! Ash's camera and I got a little shepherd's pie and two packets of turkey meatloaf muffins. It's a very American salad. These are the other couple of things I got. Just got a couple of croissants, coffee sweets, got some snackos, crunchy corn rings flavoured with sweet onion seasoning. Actually fancied some of these animal crackers. And then Pete likes, or well, so do I, but I'm trying to be good, some of this English toffee. Trader Joe's. I just took the puppies out, it's really warm. Oh, Louis at the door, we got to let him in and then give you a treat, right? Because you've been a good girl. What do you mean? Yes. While we were at Best Buy, they were selling the K-Cups. I got a donut shop coffee. And look, Matt, on your recommendation, we got Anchorman 3. Two. Two. <laughs> it's cooler out than in today nice breeze at the minute. I'm gonna go now. I have not even gotten to edit yesterday's vlog yet. It's 6.30 now on, um, what night is it? Thursday. It, it's warm in the house. There's a nice breeze outside, but it's very warm in the house. But I just wanted to show you a couple of things I got yesterday. 
while Claire and I were in Ulta. There was a lady there from the It line. As soon as I saw it went on so nicely to Claire, I was like, give it a try. It's a CC cream, color correcting, full coverage cream, SPF 50. It went on really nice. Mascara, it's gonna be hard for me to change. Tight lined, waterproof, full lash length, black primer. And I tell you, this goes on so nice. It's the tiniest little brush you've ever seen and it goes on so well. And then this under eye cream to help with the black circles. And then when we were in Target yesterday, I picked up my favorite color, all the new. I'm just getting ready to go out. Katie just left about half an hour ago. It's a little tough this afternoon <laughs> and I'm just beat. Okay, thanks. Aside from family, friends or pets, what would be the most difficult thing for you to give up in your life? I say family, friends or pets, because obviously that's everybody's first answer. So, I'm going to be really silly and say my trips to the English store on a Sunday. It'd be very hard for me to give those up. That's where I get my little piece of home every week. I can't believe, yeah, last month I was here, so it's been 32 years and one month because the oh, one month tomorrow because the 8th of july i came because you know the one nice thing we all appreciate where you live and then some you know that saying the grass is always greener i always imagine what it would be like now if we were living in england if we moved back how pete and ash would deal with it well i don't know if ash would even come at 21 but you know when we were showing matt and claire around it really gave me a renewed appreciation for where I am. Like I always appreciate when I go into the city, it's beautiful, it's big, and we're so close to it, but we're far enough away where it's quiet, quieter. Just showing them and seeing other people seeing somewhere that they've wanted to see for so long, and they appreciate it so much, it gave me like this renewed appreciation. I've been here so long now, it's just, it's my second home, and people are gonna say, it's your first home because that's where you live. No, it's just, my home will always be where I'm from. And I will always say I'm going home when I'm going on vacation or I've got to call my mum at home. That's the way it is and that's the way it will always be. And I've also been asked in the last month, why don't you get your American citizenship if you've lived here so long? It's not that easy. <laughs> I thought about it, not giving it up, but I thought about it when Pete and I got married, I wanted dual citizenship and they wouldn't do it. Now I understand, apparently they will, but I want to keep my British passport and nobody can tell me any different as, you know, wherever you're from, that's your, you know, that's where your ties are and stuff. So I feel really hot and I'm really tired. I think I don't want too much to eat. What did I have for lunch? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, definitely need something light for dinner. All right guys, let me go. Pete's actually returning phone calls as we speak. I said to him, every time I took the messages off the machine, returned calls, other people were calling in. I don't even know. I didn't even get to the few people that had called today because other people were calling and I was dealing with them. So he's gone down now to give them a call. So I'm gonna go put my earphones in. Hopefully he's not sitting in my seat and uh, get you edited, get it edited. Because I wonder if anybody wonders where the vlog is from yesterday. And I haven't really got to see many today. I watched a couple this morning. All the clouds disappeared. Though. Where is Big Brother? I just came running up the stairs and there's a flipping football game on. What is going on? Big Brother's not coming on until 2.37 a.m. So I've been rushing for now. Oh well, I've just literally ran upstairs. I've been editing the video from yesterday. Don't you want your dinner? So anyway guys, I hope whatever you did today, it was a good one. I hope you have a fantastic Thursday night and I will see you all tomorrow for another day in the life. Bye guys.